Hi guys, this is Mario from Dual Core Studio. In this episode, I will show you how to make a patrolling enemy using ray casting. Idea is to shoot an invisible ray from origin point in direction we want. And when that ray hits a wall or something, we flip the enemy and change direction. Also, we store information about object that we hit with raycasting in raycast hit variable. Since we are in 2D, we will use raycast hit 2D. Now let's take a look at our enemy. It has a rigid body, box collider and a mummy control script. Let's open it. First, we need transform origin point from which we will shoot ray. Also, we need direction in which we will shoot. That will be vector 2 with minus 1 on x because our mummy is facing left by default. It would be 1 on x if mummy is facing right. And we need two floats, range and speed. Now in fixed update use rigid body velocity to move our enemy with speed variable on x coordinate. This will move enemy left or right depending on negative or positive speed. Next let's begin with ray casting. In update we store informations in hit variable. With physics 2D raycast we shoot ray from origin point position in vector 2 direction and we choose a range of that ray. Next we check if ray hits some collider. If that is true, which collider did we hit? Let's go back to Unity to set up some things. Make sure that your wall and platform have colliders and tag that you want to use. I will use ground tag. Select enemy and create empty child game object. Change icon so we can see it and move it outside of this collider. This will be our origin point. Drag it here. Back to script. So, which collider did we hit? If hit collider tag is ground, then we want to flip enemy. Flip is function that flips enemy. Check episode 4, player flipping for more information. It's almost the same code. Also, we want to start moving in the opposite direction. For that, just multiply speed by minus 1. Next, to see ray that we are shooting, use debug draw ray. That will help you to choose range you want to use. Here we forgot one thing, but let's see that in Unity. Select enemy, choose speed and range. Click play. So when ray touches collider with tag ground, it will flip enemy, change speed, but as you can see we are still shooting ray in the negative direction. In script, multiply direction with minus 1 just as speed. Let's try this. Great, it works. Question is, what if you have this situation? Then move origin point here so it is touching ground. Change range to something small. In script, simple check if hit equals to false. So when we are not touching the ground, flip enemy, change direction and speed. Let's try this. Maybe you want to add this condition. If hit equals to false or hit tag is player. So if player stands near platform, 
heat will be true and with this extra condition you make sure that enemy will turn around. If you have this situation, make second origin point and for code use combination from previous two cases. For this origin point check if hit tag is ground and for this check if hit equals to false. Let's take a look. So we have hit 1 and hit 2. For hit 1 we check if hit equals to false and for hit 2 we check from second origin point if hit 2 tag is ground. Let's try this. Great, it works. Thank you guys for your time and see you soon.